around an office or traveling in and out of work. So I just wanted to give you a few yoga exercises that you can do from a chair. So really this class is for anybody. Share it with anyone you know that maybe sits quite a lot, any elderly relatives, um, friends. I hope it helps many of you. So we're gonna get going. All you need is a chair. Ideally one that does have a back to it, if possible, and ideally one where your feet do touch the floor. You can always put maybe some blocks or yoga blocks if they don't. So one thing that many, many people suffer with is bad posture. And quite often it can be from sitting. We spend a lot of time sitting down, even if we're not working, we might be sitting watching TV, um, sitting on a couch and our spine is not straight. So I want you to really be aware of lengthening through your spine. So even though you're sitting on a chair, maybe with a back to it, I don't want you to lean back on that back. I want you to sit upright, feet evenly on the floor. So all 10 toes, the whole of the foot, and just rest your hands on your knees. Your shoulders are nice and relaxed. Just let go of hugging the shoulders up and bring the shoulders down. I'm going to get you just to close your eyes for a few moments. So feel that lengthening all the way from the base of the spine to the top. And then each vertebrae just open with no compression. We're going to place one hand on our abdomen and one hand on our heart. And we're going to start to take a few breaths here. So as you breathe in through your nose, Visualise the breath's journey through the throat, through the chest, down into the lungs and just feeling the body expand as it breathes in that life force energy, that prana. And as you exhale, letting go of the breath, Feeling the body softening. And as you breathe in here, I want you to visualize breathing in positive energy. Feeling that positive energy just flow through the whole of the body. And as you exhale, I want you to let go of negativity. It can be anything, maybe something you've watched, the news, the media, something somebody said, maybe how you might be feeling about yourself. I want you to let it go. It does not serve you. Breathing in through the nose. And slowly releasing that breath out. And you can come back to this breath whenever you need. If you're having a stressful moment. Maybe if you suffer with high blood pressure and use this breath to reduce that, to slow down, to let go of any stress. And one more breath here. And then just slowly open your eyes. We're going to bring our hands back to our knees. 
We're going to breathe in, expand the chest open and just pull the arms back, looking upwards. And then as you exhale, roll the spine in, tuck in the chin to the chest. So this is cat cow seated. So we're breathing in, we're looking up, pulling the shoulders back. And we're exhaling, rolling the breath through the spine, tucking the chin in. Let's do a few more of these. So breathing in. And exhaling out. It might feel good just to close the eyes again here. Pause between the breaths. And then once again, lengthening back to that straight back. Shoulders relaxed. Let's tuck the chin in once again. Close the eyes and just roll through the head. Make sure your spine is long. Keep the movement slow. The neck is another area that holds a lot of compression. We want to open and lengthen through the neck. Release any stagnant energy. And we're going to reverse our circle. One more circle. We're still breathing in and out through the nose. The breath is long. to centre when you're ready. And back to your long breath. This time as we breathe in, we're going to bring up the arms and stretch upwards, reaching up, maybe bringing the palms together. And then we're going to exhale, pull the elbows back and look up like you're squeezing your shoulder blades. Breathe in, reach up. Exhale, squeeze. Breathe in, arms come up. Exhale, squeeze. Let's do one more, reaching up. Exhale, squeeze. Inhale up. And release the arms back down. Hands back to the knees. This time we're breathing in, we're reaching up. And we're exhaling, rolling forwards over our legs. Dropping the head releasing the head down. You should feel a lovely stretch through your back. Just let the head hang. No tension in the neck. Remember if it's difficult to come this low, you can just keep your hands on your knees and drop forward from here. take two more breaths. So it's very important in yoga to listen to your body. You're not pushing it. You're taking care. Let's take one more breath. And then when ready, Roll the spine really slowly back up to 
pushing each vertebrae back up to seated. Coming back to long spine. How good does that feel on your back? Just that release, that lengthening. And the more you practice sitting like this, the more natural it will become for you, I promise. It does feel quite alien sometimes to sit with a straight back. So we're gonna take our left leg over our right. Plant your right foot on the floor, make sure that foot's not lifting. We're gonna hug our knee with our right hand and we're gonna take a twist behind us. So maybe you want to just hold your chair here. Maybe you might have space to rest your hand down behind you. And we want to look towards our left shoulder. Pull that left shoulder back. Come back to your long breath. Breathing all the way into the belly. This is a great for our digestion and our internal organs. Let's take one more breath here. Very slowly roll yourself back. Let's draw that knee in, rotate through the foot. Come back in both ways. Again, if it's difficult to hold the knee, you can rotate through the foot, just resting that heel down. And we're going to release, plant that left foot back to the floor. So let's change sides. Let's take the right leg over the left. Make sure that left foot is planted down. You can bring it in a little into the centre of your body. Our left hand is going to hold our left knee. Our spine is still long. And we're going to take that twist behind. So send your right hand behind you, either to the back of the chair or plant it on the chair itself and pull your right shoulder back. We're coming back to that long breath. And maybe a good practice to do if you have a lunch break, just before you eat, get that digestion going. And one more breath, all the way into the belly. Coming back to centre when you're ready, planting that foot back down. Close the eyes, rest the hands on the knees. Make sure you're lengthening through the spine. Coming back to that connection with the breath. As you breathe in, just visualize a healing light coming in through the crown of your head, all the way through the body down to the feet. And as you exhale, you let go of anything that no longer serves you. Breathing in that healing white light. And exhaling back up from the feet. through the body. Let's take one more breath. And 
slowly. And bring your hands to your heart. Thank yourself for your practice today. And bow to Namaste. Thank you so, so much. I hope it helped you. I will be sharing another chair sequence shortly. So look out for that one. Have a wonderful day and I will see you very, very soon. Take care.